For the cervical range of motion, make sure that the model head is outside the bed. Don't leave the head uh, without support. Uh, you need to carry the head with your fingers underneath the occipital bone and your thumb in front of the ears. Now we can move into head extension by tipping the head backward, cervical flexion, by bringing the chin into the chest, cervical lateral bending or lateral flexion, by bringing the ear to the shoulder, the right and the left, and cervical rotation by bringing the chin to the shoulder, rotation to the right, and rotation to the left.